happened since uh, we posted last and Pierre has been working like crazy on this build. I would like him to tell you guys what makes our build a pro level drift car and what makes it stand out from your average drift car. Yeah, let's go for a tour. I'm gonna show you five things. First thing, engine positioning. We put the engine maximum in the back, low as possible, we get the chance to have a dry sun system on the car so the engine sits very low. We have top plank mount on the rail that gives us the best weight distribution we can have. Second thing, bracing the strut rail and the front assembly. We need a lot of strength on the front end for a drift car so that way we add reinforcement. We put them as a maximum on the inside of the car to prevent any crash. Like that we don't want the shock store open. And the last thing, nothing touch the firewall as the regulation in Formula Drift has. Third thing, and which is very important for a high pro drift car, is the front and rear end. We always build them the same way. Pretty rigid structure on the front which protects all the accessories. And from that, we have like the first point of contact which is gonna bend pretty easily and save everything on the back. And look, same for the rear. Strong structure and something pretty easy to bend for any contact. And yeah, we all know crashed happen. So be sure we already have spares ready to go. Okay, number four. As we have the radiator in the back, we put all the cooling line under this gallery. Coming on the engine bay, we're gonna make custom rigid line in aluminum with like a bleeding point as high as possible. And after it's just gonna be soft line for the end. Number five, the refueling. To prevent any spilling, we put the fuel neck at like 45 degrees, like that the fuel goes straight. You don't have everything coming out when it's like on the windows. And second thing is not on the plastic window, which is gonna crack straight with the race fuel. And uh, we have one more thing to show you guys, something very excited and unique for the build. We have this custom made white body kit that's gonna go on top. It's gonna give that extra aggressive look that's gonna make the car really stand out from the competitors.